right, y'all. This is like the 58th time of me trying to record for you guys. Um, I got to get back into the swing of vlogging, you guys. Like, y'all obviously see that I've been in my reaction bag. But I ain't going to lie. It's fun as doing the reactions are, to be honest with you guys. It's kind of making me lazy when it comes to doing my vlogs. Not with everything else in terms of being responsible, but when it comes to the vlogs. Like, the vlogs take hella time to edit and not so much when it comes to reactions. And plus with the reactions, a lot of people have been requesting that I come through with them, but it's time for me to get back in my vlog. Like, I love vlogging more than anything. That's the reason why we created a vlog channel and actually made it a vlog channel. On top of that, you know, we push fitness content and regular vlogs in general, but it's time for me to get back in my vlog bag because I'm just missing it so much. On top of that, I'm starting to forget how to vlog. I'm starting to forget how to hold a camera and park at the same time. But we're here, y'all, today. We're training today. I have back, and hopefully, I can get some footage for you guys. I say that all the time, but in reality, it'd be kind of difficult. But I'm gonna make it come through for you. Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys watch the entire vlog. Welcome back to the Strength Squad Kitchen And right now I'm excited to share with you guys One of my go-to meals This right here guys I literally can have this every day And if you want to consider something like this If you're dieting, have no fear I got you If you're bulking, have no fear I got you If you're maintaining, have no fear I got you I'm just going to show you guys a few ways to modify this burrito To where I promise you You will be able to fit it into your calories Into your macros Whatever nutrition plan you have I promise you guys I got you covered Just a heads up guys I already cooked everything So I do apologize Apologize for not taking you guys walking you guys through the process of me cooking it however if you guys really want that video I promise you guys I will come through and deliver for you guys all I need is for you guys to come through and tell me that you really want me to do it and um, I'll take time out of my day to make sure that I show you guys exactly how I whipped it but for the most part I'm just gonna give you guys the basics the things that you'll need feel free to season it up make as many modifications um, according to whatever suits you your taste buds your macros I'm just giving you guys the general basis of what you guys will need in order to make this work all right so the foundation the burrito um that we're going to use for this wrap this right here guys has been one of my greatest discoveries this is made by joseph's it's called joseph's lavish bread this right here y'all as you can see look at how much burrito we have it's a nice size burrito for very little calories and um i'll talk to you guys about that in a second but this burrito also incorporates flax oat bran and whole wheat on top of that we also 
include omega threes, guys. We have omega threes in this burrito. That's not even talking about the fiber. That's not even including the protein, guys. Besides the Mission Tortilla Wraps, um, those are my alternate favorites. But this right here, guys, has definitely hands down become my favorite wrap. There's no way in the world that you're gonna ever catch me in the crib without having a supply of this right here because it's really, really a game changer, guys. In brief, let's go ahead and go over the calories real quick, y'all. Keep in mind this is two servings, so half of this would be 60 calories, half of it will be 1.5 grams of fat, 8 grams of carbs, and 6 grams of protein. But of course, we want to make the gain, so we definitely want to make sure that we incorporate the whole thing. It's only 120 calories when you count it all up. So for the entire flatbread, we're looking at 120 calories, 3 grams of fat, 16 carbs, 12 grams of protein guys that is crazy numbers if you ask me only 120 calories y'all to have this whole burrito it sounds weird it sounds crazy it sounds unnatural especially in comparison to other burritos where the calories are high there's hardly any benefits in the burrito it's just pretty much stuffing you with a bunch of carbs with no benefits but this right here is the fix guys matter of fact I almost forgot about the fiber where's oh we're looking at two grams of fiber so of course when you're eating the whole thing we're talking about four additional grams of fiber and that's not including the beans which we'll get to in a minute so guys in my opinion this right here is one of the best on the market next up we're going to go with some black beans as you can see somebody been um dipping into the black beans but it's all good have no fear we keep black beans on deck this right here provides an extra source of fiber on top of a few extra carbs and of course it provides an additional source of protein so with this i'm pretty much just going to stick with one serving which is 0.5 grams of fat which is pretty good 22 grams of carbs the good carbs six grams of fiber you definitely need that fiber and we're looking at seven grams seven additional grams of protein keep in mind one serving is a half a cup which is equivalent to 130 grams just take a notation of that when you guys do weigh your food all you want to do is make sure that you're weighing 130 grams to make sure that you are getting the numbers that you need and then plug it in your my fitness power app or whatever app that you use and then you're in business all right so i'm going to eat the rest of this of course but then i'm going to cook this and then weigh it all out next up guys this right here again i told you guys i cooked everything in advance this is ground turkey this is ground turkey feel free to swap it out with ground chicken or ground beef it's been a while since i did ground turkey and to be honest with you guys i always eat ground beef i kind of wanted to take a bit of a break from the ground beef the red meat so i decided to go ahead and switch it out with ground turkey and it tastes great don't get it twisted i know everybody are fans of red meat or ground beef but this right here tastes phenomenal um, i know it's not serving no justice right now because it's been refrigerated but i'm gonna pretty much just wear out my portion um, i'm going with six ounces and then I'm going to throw it in the pan, let it warm up for a little bit And then pretty much piece everything together, alright So pretty much we're just going to cook this up, y'all And then we're going to throw it on the lavish bread And then we're going to add our black beans And then the last thing that we're going to do, guys Is just add some fat-free mozzarella cheese On top of the fact that it's fat-free, guys Keep in mind, it only adds a few extra carbs And for one serving, nine additional grams of protein So as you can see, the protein is adding up really fast Just easy ways to get in the protein Especially when it's kind of hard to get during your dieting process and as far as the sauce of choice I'm going to add this just a little bit I'm going to go with one serving just to kind of give it more flavor and um, we're going to go with Boathouse Farm Classic Ranch to me out of all of the flavors that they have this hands down is the best some of you guys may can relate I've tried different companies that have fat free ranch or half the fat ranch or zero calorie ranch and all of it tastes ass excuse my French but I'm just being honest with you guys this right here I promise you guys is the fix it's only 50 calories per serving which is I believe two tablespoons which is not bad so I'm pretty much just going to go with two tablespoons and it's only going to add an additional 50 calories which is not bad last but not least guys I'm going to chop up some tomatoes just to add volume get some extra vegetables in it and if you're bulking all you have to do guys if your goal is to put on some socks just go ahead and add some rice this right here is brown rice I also have white rice in the fridge too but I'm actually going to ditch this for the simple fact that I'm not bulking for the most part I'm maintaining I would like to dial back the calories a little bit so I'm just going to ditch the rice but just sharing with you guys what you can do if you did need extra carbs or just wanted to add a few extra carbs then all you have to do is just add a few extra grains of your choice whether it's jasmine rice brown rice whatever you guys want to do to get the volume to get the calories just sharing with you guys how you can actually add more calories if that's your goal but for me i'm going to pretty much ditch this and 
keep it as clean as possible. So altogether, guys, this is a high protein, minimal carb, very low in fat meal, guys. This burrito is action packed. It will fill you up. I'll make sure that I put all the macros down um, when it comes to the serving size that I'm using. I'm pretty much just sticking to the script when it comes to everything that you see on the cans and jars. The only thing I'm doing different is adding two extra ounces of the ground turkey. Um, as far as the serving size, of course, it's four ounces. I'm going to do two extra ounces altogether, six ounces so that we can get more protein. I forgot to mention I'm using 93.7 lean ground turkey. Feel free to go leaner if you want. Feel free to get the fattier one. Just make sure you guys are tracking it um, to make sure that you're not messing up on your diet. But this is pretty much the gist of it. Wanted to make sure that I did most of the talking before I put it together. So I'm actually going to turn the camera off and put it together and just show you guys what it looks like right before I actually tackle this bad boy and eat it. Um, but I'm excited about it, y'all. I have this at least a couple times a week. So I'm getting ready to put this together, guys. Feel free to take notes. If you have any questions, anything specific, if you feel like I missed anything out, feel free to come through in the comments with your questions. I'm a friendly guy. I love the world. Just don't come with nothing weird and we good. But um, anyway, y'all, let me whip this up and uh, show you guys what it look like at the end of the day you feel me all right guys finally our meal is up and you can see all of the good gains just waiting to be fed in the muscles y'all my muscles is craving right now you cannot tell me that this does not look like a vibe just trying to show you guys that dieting does not always have to be bland it don't have to be boring it's just all about getting creative using the same exact ingredients that would typically go into bland boring meals and just you know getting creative man showing you guys how to actually make tasty meals while dieting as you can see this has my name written all over it i'm getting ready to shuttle these into the muscles man and make some gains so i'm gonna eat this crush this and i'm holla charge the next part of this video mm, 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 mm. All right, you guys, this will conclude today's video. If you happen to have enjoyed any aspect of this video, if you found it motivational, informative, whatever the case may be, if you liked it, I need you guys to show support. I need the like army to come through each and every one of you guys and like the video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, lock all the way in, turn on your post notifications. That way you won't miss none of my content. Keep in mind, this is a good vibe community, so all negativity will be blocked. I don't play no games when it comes to that. But if you're positive, that's the tip we on. That's the vibe we on. We're here to grow together, all right? As always, do what brings life to you And it's a great chance that you'll bring life To whatever it is that you do To the next video, you already know The goal is to hashtag grow Appreciate all the love and support that we get here on the channel I will catch you guys in the next one Peace and blessings, one love, strength